Welcome back to Miller Music Studios TV. Today we have the second lesson preparing you for Twinkle Twinkle Little Star Variation A from the Suzuki Method. Today we're doing the left hand. The first lesson was the right hand. So, we're using Suzuki Piano School Volume 1 and now we're on page 12. And it's the first study for the left hand. The rhythm that we're going to use is going to be Taka Taka Hot Dog. And you can clap that before you do this with your child. But if that's not the best saying, or if you need variety, you can say Mississippi Hot Dog, or Pepperoni Pizza, Charlie Brown and Snoopy, Peanut Butter Sandwich. For most children, what works for me is Taka Taka Hot Dog, or taka taka up up. So let's talk about where we're going to place our fingers. First we want to find middle C. If you had a piano, usually the first letter of the name of the piano is pretty much around middle C. And there's a group of two black keys to the left of that, or you could say before the group of two black keys, is middle C. Then if you go down to a group of three black keys and the next group of two black keys, to the left of that is the C that we want. That's the C below middle C. And you put your fifth finger, which is your pinky, and I'm going to label all of them so that you can see uh, how I label them. Here's the markers. We have C, then D, E, F, G. That will be finger numbers five, four, three, two, one. I'll show you how the paper looks up here and you'll be able to hear it and then we'll redo it so that you can actually see me doing it. So we have two C's for the fifth finger. So I'll point as I go and it would be taka taka hot dog, taka taka hot dog. And then the fourth finger will have two sets of taka taka hot dog and this will be on D and D. Taka taka hot dog, taka taka hot dog. Then the third finger, two sets for E. That sounds like taka taka hot dog, taka taka hot dog. Now two sets for the second finger on F. Taka taka hot dog, taka taka hot dog. Two sets for finger number one, the thumb, on G. And that will be taka taka hot dog, taka taka hot dog. Now let's talk about the placement of your fingers. So here you can see the C, D, E, F, G. And we're going to start with finger number five. One, two, three, four, five is the pinky. Now be careful because the pinky oftentimes wants to lie down flat. And there's a reason for this. See, if you put your hands in your lap, it's basically curved for your body. So now, watch, if we put this up to the piano, finger is flat. So we have to do this. You turn your hands towards each other. And in the olden days, they put a coin on the back of the hand to make sure that the hand was in the right position. And you pretend like you're holding a bubble. And you're playing the fifth finger on the tip. So I'm going to use the wrist approach. You know, you could be going from your elbow, like, which is good for a lot of children, but otherwise, it's easier for me, like this, from the wrist. Taka taka hot dog, taka taka hot dog. Then you get the fourth finger on the next key, which is D. Taka taka hot dog, taka taka hot dog. And the knuckles like to cave in. Uh, before your hand is really strong. So you have to help your child. Maybe you have to support behind this joint with your thumb. And third finger on E. Taka taka hot dog. Taka taka hot dog. Second finger on F. Taka taka hot dog. Taka taka hot dog. And the first 
first finger on the G. Here's another angle for you for the thumb because it's so important. If your thumb goes flat and later on, like let's say you're trying to do a chord, you might get more than one note. So it's very important for your thumb to be upright. So you want it upright and you want to train your child to do this right from the start. So you have their happy face here and they kiss the piano like that. And you see how it's a little upright? It's at an angle. It's not flat. It's not on the knuckle. It's a little upright. And your fingers are the same direction as your arm because your child may want to do like this. So we have to have the fingers a little curved. And when you do your thumb, you play it like this. Taka, taka, hot, dog. Taka, taka, hot, dog. I hope you enjoyed this tutorial. So for a whole week, I hope you're practicing the right hand alone. And now for a whole week, practice your left hand alone. And the next lesson, I'll show you how to play hands together. Happy practicing.